everybody, old folks here. So, uh, I wanted to record the breaking out, hopefully, of my Luke here. Some people have different opinions on him. Not a bad guy. He's got the healing debuff, which works good against uh, teams that do a lot of lifesteal. But um, let's go ahead and see what happens with 140 soul stones. Um, obviously, I, I know that uh, the average person says, hey, that's just kind of a waste. But you know, I just like to show you what can happen, what can't happen in forty. So one hundred and forty. So let's let's go from there. So obviously, at this point, we've gotten the top three filled. So now we just have to get the bottom three filled. Um, you won't lose the top three, but you can lose the bottom two. I know that from experience on Kong Ming on my other <laughs> server, because he will never seemingly finish those bottom three. Um, just like that. <laughs> just like that. So we're down to 60. Yeah, our chances are running real slim. Obviously now, there we go, we got a silver. So it took 140 soul stones to get that far. Um, this is why breakouts get so frustrating. Uh, and like I told other people, you know, I had a, a mirror that took me 800 soul stones. So, um, there's not much you can do about it. Sometimes I think they've got their ratios a little jacked, but I'm not the man upstairs. I don't get to make those decisions. But here you go. Hopefully that helps you kind of have an idea on how many soul stones it takes just to even get the silver star. Sometimes it's real lucky. I've got a video or I got real lucky on my other guys, but I just like to show it. I like to save it um, because I prefer having a greater chance of maybe feeling like I accomplished something. Obviously, I would have been a little frustrated if I hadn't, but you never know. So thanks for watching. Uh, again, if you guys got any questions, uh, feel free to ask. I'll gladly answer them. And uh, have a great day, everybody.